death. And yes, we are playing Life is Strange 2. Now, we are here. Oh my god. Everything went south at the grandparents' house. The police showed up. We had to save Chris. I knew we shouldn't have went to the damn store. I had a feeling. I knew something was gonna happen. I just knew. But you know what? You couldn't just keep Daniel cooped up in the house all day. And that caused enough commotion for us to be able to say, we gotta dip out. Because the police would have came and it would have been a whole nother thing. So let's just see where we ended up. Last I remember, we was going with that girl, Cassidy, that we had met singing in the market to the puff farm. Let's see how they handle this. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together, but one day, hunters took their dad away. No. Forever. So now the brothers were alone, and they had to find a new home. That's when the big brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. And then they worked together to learn how to use his power and to follow the rules for them. They discovered a secret hideout where they could train day and night. They were happy. But the little wolf got very sick. So they had to move on. On the way, a deadly predator attacked them. But the little one destroyed it using his power. Mm. They decided to journey to the home of their nearby ancestors to seek help. Finally, the tired and hungry brothers made it to the home of their ancestors. The old wolves invited them to stay. They even took care of them. They were happy to have a safe, warm place to rest. The little wolf even made friends with a raccoon. And together, they went on awesome adventures. Unfortunately, hunters were hot on their trail and found them. But the tiny raccoon helped the brothers escape and almost got hurt. The brothers had nowhere to stay again, so they decided to keep going south to the distant homeland of their Papa Wolf. Life is Strange 2 is a story-based game that highlights player choice. Your actions and decisions will have consequences that impact the world around you and your brother. Choose wisely.
Hi. Where are we? Are we in another abandoned house? A day in his room. Oh, no uh. way, you little shit. Daniel, get your ass over here now. He's so busted. Oh, he got that, yeah. Man, that would fucking kill me if he found this. So he better not find it. I mean, he, he kind of got that, yeah, in the bag. Need to put on the patch I bought last week. Of course. Like, I want to play fucking hide and seek. I should take one of his little toys, see how he like it. Ooh, that confiscated the play box after that. Daniel was a total rage ball. I don't got time for your little, I don't got time for your little games. Oh, no time for this. Where are you? Maybe he's invisible now? Whoa, hold on. <gasps> Let go! S stop it! Dude, I told <gasps> you to stay out of my room. Ow! That hurt! Yeah, I'm not fucking around anymore. Got it? Mm -hmm. Do you hear me, Daniel? You shall not enter your brother's room. No! Watch out, man! You started it, dickhead! What is this crap? Are you fighting again? You proud of yourself? Stop it! Enough! Getting tired of this. Sean, what happened? Now! We were just goofing around, Dad. I swear. He started it. He always gets mad. He's totally lying. You little enough. You both better listen because I'm tired of this crap. Okay? 
This is my house too, not your playground. You hear me? Jeez. You guys are working my last nerve this week. You okay, mijo? I'm going to talk with your brother. You know the drill. Bedroom and no games. I didn't do anything. Uh-huh. Let's talk. Oh, now. This is so stupid. It's bullshit. Okay. You really taught that book a lesson. You done? Hmm? Whatever. Like you're gonna believe me. Daniel's always right. Look. Please? <sighs> Listen, Sean. I can't do this on my own. I... I can't. I need you to help me. I know you don't want to babysit Daniel. You grow up. You need space. More freedom. I get it. But we're a trio now, and you gotta take some responsibility. That little shit is just a kid. You're almost an adult. You know what, you're I right. I know that. And I do look out for him. I swear. But he's a little brat. So were you. And you had... Eight years of being spoiled before you had to share toys with your little brother. I know it might sound cheesy, but we have to be good role models for him. He's a Diaz, right? Yeah. Okay, I hear you. I'll try to be super bro. Just try to be there for him, like you are now. Yeah, <laughs> says mi hijo. I'm late for work. Go talk to your brother and work this drama out. We'll go to the movies tonight if you guys don't wreck the house. I know you love to hear this. But I'm proud of you. Both of you. Okay. Get back to work. You gotta look out for your brother. But it's like, come on, bro, stay out my room. So much bullshit. But I got phone and party bills now. Come in. It's the big bad brother. No! Stay out! Get your open. I said no! Get out! Whatever! I'm not listening! La 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 la! I Come don't on, hear anything! Dude. La 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 la! Uh, what Lila say? Man, <laughs> my brother's a little player. Lila loves it. <laughs> he sent her a little box of candy. That's cute. Okay, Daniel. Hmm. <sighs> I better do something about Daniel. I don't know how to do this big brother shit. I'm not a brother. Hey, Daniel. Leave me alone. Come on. Okay. And don't touch my stuff. Too bad. Oh, I forgot about Bobby the Yeti. <laughs> I brought it back from that field trip to Vancouver. I mean, who does that? Other than a super cool big brother. 
Ah, he's right, Daniel. You should totally forgive him. See? I'm not saying it. Bobby does. <laughs> Leave me alone! Boy. Sean, I'm gonna tell on you. I mean... Tim, haven't seen you in forever. Hmm. That made me give this to you. You always wanted my toys. Does this even work anymore? Not after you took care of it. Poor robot. No battery. Duh. Why are you still here? Oh, you kept this guy. We got him from that creepy circus, remember? We wanted him so bad. Got him for you shooting at that freaking target. Yeah, right. Dad, aim the gun. So what? You mm. still won. Because of me. I can't hear you. Just leave me alone. Oh, Daniel. Hey, that's cool. Did you make it? Be careful. Whoa. It's fragile. No problem. Suddenly, you're Mr. Careful. Mm. Okay, if I sit down. So, when did you get this? Last month. Dad said I should learn to do stuff by myself since you're not around as much hey come on it's not like i'm leaving home you might as well i never see you we don't even play games anymore we don't do anything daniel i just i want to hang out with my friends sometimes you're gonna be doing the same thing in a couple of years hi want to grow up. It's boring. Facts? But... Here. Sorry I took it. That's what you wanted? That stupid watch? You said you'd give me one. At the thrift store last week. But you forgot. Like before. Well... You better keep this watch then. Sean, this is so cool. I'll keep it forever and ever. Sorry, no. Your brother's getting along. My bro, little bros.
Beaver Creek feels so far away. Hmm. We used to have big rooms. Now all our stuff fits in a bag. much money we got we just saved up a good little stack Daniel keeps reading it again and again I told him not to count on her he won't listen Another month, and we'll be hooked up for Mexico. Hmm. Still can't believe we ran into the guys again. Talk about fucking fate. Yep, I'm a real man now. Ooh. Kind of. Let's get the hell out of here. Wash eyes. Hey, bedhead. Had a good sleep? Oh. Hi, uh. Yeah, I, I did. Thanks. Nice. Okay. I better hit the shower before they use all the water. Right. See you around. Hey, Sean. Breakfast time. to take the pen, dude. Nope. You can't do anything without looking up first. <sighs> okay. Big hair. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. Hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. Cool. I think I'm ready to draw this. Time to take the pen, dude. <sighs> okay, got it. Mm, that's talent. Never seen a dog so chilled. Doesn't care about anything. Yeah. Like you don't get pet enough around here. Did you see all that fog earlier? 
creeps me out. I don't know what's inside. Like that. What? You hear that? Um, I heard nothing, Penny. Mm, maybe it was the coffee brewing. Never mind. You can't hear? Only me. I don't understand. Why? How you miss all those insects? How the fuck? The swarm is coming. No. You mean bugs? I haven't seen any flying bugs. Not in the winter, at least. Sean. Sean. Narc, stealth drones, all that shit. Wake up, boy. Look up. You saw them? When? How? Because Vision and Sean, they watching us now. Me and Anders to lose the job. The cash is good for us to travel. Same here. Plus, this was a steady gig. Mm. Don't want to hit the road yet. Tanya won't either. Don't puss out at the narc show. Meryl takes care of his peeps. Yeah, he's a major dick. But fair. He always puts us to work every season. Some of us need this shit job. Not the tourists here. Kush gig. Not when they legalize that shit. Then you can work legal on the farm, right? Not if the no. government steps in. Then the pigs, pill pushers, all bad. It's legal in Washington, and it's worked out okay. It's gonna be legal everywhere, soon anyway. Legal but controlled. By who? The bitches who made it against the law. Yay, freedom. I don't know. Things have to change. Back. Oh, um, did anybody see Daniel? I haven't seen him this morning. I saw him walking with Finn. They were headed to the lake. Thanks, Ingrid. I Thank you, Ingrid. better see what he's up to. Tell him no swimming. That lake is toxic, man. Nasty. I keep thinking <laughs> you're Dutch. Welcome to Cafe Diaz. <laughs> because we try my special from morning again? Nice. I like that gourmet shit. Sweden, Malmö. You wouldn't hear about it. Most of them are into fancy a hippie food way to work a farm. and fast food junk. Yeah, been working for three years in a coffee shop to pay for the trip. Hope that shit was worth it. Oh yeah, good times. Yep, I'm up for some heavy barrel lifting tonight. Yay! I wish we came sooner. I feel like we will never see everything now. You did. Gotta ride with us, right? We shower like once or twice a week. True. Gives us more time to chill, right? Mm. So many missing persons around here. Creepy. Hmm. We always pet the dog. There will never be a day I don't pet dog. Shoot, what's the date today? Is it the 15th or 16th? Jake's stuff is always so tidy and neat. Just like him. What's what up, up Jake? Jacob? Hey, Sean. Not much. What do you got going on there? Uh, this is a birthday card for my little sister. <sighs> Don't laugh. Aw, that's cute. How old is she? She's nine years old now. <sighs> like Daniel. Do you miss her? I'd probably miss her the most. I'm kind of jealous you get to hang out with your brother all the time. Hmm. But I, I bet it's hard to be his brother and father figure. That's my job now. 
Full-time Daniel Wrangler. He's really yep. lucky to have you. Hey, since you're such a pro big bro, what's a good way to end this letter? Goodbye sounds a bit lame, right? Well, what's she what into? is she into? Like anime or video games? Uh, puppies? <laughs> she has a pet chicken named Alexander. Sarah loves that thing, but it creeps me out. <laughs> <laughs> Why not draw a creepy portrait of Alexander? Good idea. It'll match my <laughs> chicken scratch perfectly. Anyway, thanks for your help, Sean. I gotta finish this before I get ready for work. Don't want to be late or Big Joe will eat me for lunch. You and me both. See you later, Jake. Sean, thanks again, man. Wish it rained more. Nice to get fresh free water. These guys have top gear. Wish I did. Now let's go check on our brother. And make sure everything's good. Funny how I like being out in the forest now. I actually feel free. What the fuck, man? You're awesome. He better not know. Once again. Yes, I'm the man. <laughs> Holy shit. That was dope. What's up, guys? Morning target practice? Six bullseyes in a row. Kid is a fucking ninja. Hey, mm. we didn't want to wake your sleepy ass up. Yeah, thank you for that. You okay, Daniel? Hey, seriously. I've never seen anyone throw like that. Wow. Then trained you well. Six bullseyes, dude. Yeah, I got better. Lucky. You can't throw a baseball without hitting me in the nuts. How did you learn to aim so good? Not true, liar. You're the one who sucks at baseball. Yeah, right. Hey, wow. What's up We're with you? We're at odds. I should have let you know, but but I'm watching him like a hawk. Seriously, much respect. He's like my own blood. And not that I'm as hot or cool as his big bro. Yo, Sean. He's calling idea. me hot. I want to see if Daniel inherited the family blade skills from you. How about a little demo? It was my turn. Come on, let's give the man a chance. Okay. Yeah. I'll take a shot. Okay, so how do we do this? Between the fucking eyes. Damn. Oh. oh. Did you guys escape from some circus? Mm. That was just luck. Seriously, that shit was off the chain. Mm. One time is luck. Second time is skill. So let's see. I go. Come on, Sean. Show us your talents. Let's show the kid what's what. <laughs> hmm? Oh, fuck that! <laughs> Miss, see, I rule. <laughs> Sorry, Daniel. Sean. You're not Why? a ninja, but you're still cool. Just ask your brother for help next time. <laughs> yeah. What would I do without him? Hey, don't look at me. It's not my fault if you can't throw. Woo! 
After that workout, I need some more fucking Java. Wait! Don't go yet? Ah, uh, it's all good, Daniel. We can practice later. Yeah, if it's cool with <laughs> Big Brother. <laughs> Love you, man. What now? Why did you do that? You think that shit is funny? What shit? Stop acting stupid. You're pushing it, Daniel. You made me miss in front of Finn. What if he finds out, huh? What then? I'm not stupid. He won't find out. You don't know that. Oh, Daniel. You're gonna get busted, Inano. You need to listen to me. Stop calling me that. I'm not a kid anymore. Daniel, don't. Why? See? Stop, Daniel. Now. Or what? I said stop, Daniel. Don't run me! Uh. Uh. I'm sorry. I didn't Daniel. mean to be that hard. I'm okay. It's fine. I told you. You're good. But you don't have control over your powers yet. Yeah, but we stopped training since we got here. We'd rather hang out with their new friends. Well, because we need to fit in if we want to keep that job, okay? But you're right. Let's, um, do some training later today. All right. Cool? Yeah. We got to put in Go more time with Daniel. Today. Him acting like this is not but, it. Sean. Because if he wilds out, then what? Stay here. It's been like a month. I know, but we need more money to get to Porto Lobos. Remember? It's gonna take forever. We should try and find Mom. Since we have her letter now. We end with this? We had this conversation. Sorry, Daniel, but we can't. We don't even know where... Karen really is, and we can't risk getting caught while looking for her. She's one of the reasons we're out here. That's why we're going down to Mexico. How come the I never get to choose? I'm the one with the power. I hear you. It's not fair. But you're my brother. My responsibility. I have to take care of you. I know. But I'm not gonna be a kid forever. Finn treats me like an adult. He understands. Hmm. Uh-oh. Big Joe. Shit. Hey, you don't wear your watch anymore? What? Oh. Nah, I put this on instead. Finn gave it to me. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, pretty cool. Him and Finn. Hey, Daniel. Remember what I said. Low profile. <sighs> yeah. Okay. What cool. I don't like working on a farm. I know. It could be way worse. We're making cash, you know. Okay, okay. Wish we could send Chris a present. Or something. Or maybe just check on him. We will, Daniel. When we're safe and far away. I know. I had fun playing hide and seek last night. Especially in the dark. You weren't scared at all? <laughs> Come on. Not with Finn. We had the best hiding spot.
sit here, my man. I need a bodyguard like you. Cool. Tell Sean to get me a knife. Mind if I sit here? Sure. Yeah. Yes, you may. <laughs> Why so serious? Uh, nothing. Just thinking. Cool. I'm always worried about my city boy. Everyone here? This isn't a fucking school ah. bus. Oh. We're late. Am I about to deliver the yeah? Am I about to deliver Because Cassidy is looking ripe? So at this point, you know, I'm like, whatever, dude, knife, just right? give me more booze, <laughs> you know? Yeah. I don't bullshit you. Some gutter punk jump. You're not listening to anything I say. Are you? Yeah. What? Jeez, yes, I am. Cut me too. Party. Oh, shit. Too, too much monkey. sex, guys. Are you okay? Too much sex. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I was two fees in a pod, these ones. I'll show you the battle scope. Oh, this whole high last night. Are you showing jealous? Nah, I love just you, keeping you an eye careful out, with that, you know? Though. Yeah, okay. <laughs> big brother watching. Hey, who's the next That's master here on theft? Did you lock the tent? You wouldn't see stuff for shooting in that even. So, Wrong. how do you feel? You went back for the lighter. Who knew this little tree market snowflake would end up here? Yeah. <laughs> with us misfits. I feel free to be I real. actually feel free. <laughs> it's been a long time. Oh no. Thanks to you. I hope so. Finn and me had a bet how long you would last. Okay. Please don't hurt me. I lost. Thanks. I'm glad you did. Can't get rid of me yet. Hey, I'm gonna shut the fuck up back there. I can't hear my music. Guess what? He was on his secret sat phone again this morning. Speaking Romanian and shit. Oh no. Here it comes. He's agent 420. And he has a license to cook. <laughs> um, what's that? Told you a thousand times, Big Joe is a clone. They come from a factory of Silicon Valley. <laughs> Maybe he's just the factory reject. Bigfoot. Think about it. Big Joe, Bigfoot. Whoa. <laughs> you might be on something. They both smell. Stinky, Big Joe. <laughs> Shit, you're all in love with Big Joe. You can't stop talking about him, I swear. But his ass is too big. <laughs> <laughs> right on. Come on. <laughs> <sighs> yep. He's kind of a mystery. Hey, pipe down back there. Enjoy the scenery for a change, for fuck's sake. Fucking tired. Stop your bitching or get out of here. Oh. Jeez. Hey. 
Come on, man. Hey, come on. That's not cool. Uh, are you really shit talking me, Cheech? <laughs> huh? Forget it, Sean. Seriously. Hmm. We're late. Hey, you're gonna get us kicked out of here. Well, I just want it to. What? Be a white knight? I can take care of myself, Sean. Bro, that guy would have beat you down. I just don't like people bullying folks. Oh, thanks for coming. <laughs> I'm not your way, right? Uh, no, no, we're sorry. We, we just... You don't get paid to be late. Next time you won't be. <laughs> Listen up. I need two teams today. Finn, Penny, Anders. And what's your name will clean up the mess from the storm. Yeah. The rest of you get to sit and trim. Like I want to go pick up a bunch of shit all over the camp. Hey, you want to trade places? Shut up, Daniel. You got a deal, kid. Yeah! I get to go outside. Hey! You guys still don't get it. This is work, not a goddamn summer camp. You're not special. There are dozens of hippies like yourselves begging for work at the next town. Kid, your dad should teach you to shut your mouth. Finn, you better watch your guys. Of course, boss. No problem. Okay, so move it. Yeah, you heard the man. Stop fucking around and get in your teams, all right? Hold up. You and me are going to talk. Remember, I'm only letting you and your brother work here because Finn put in a good word. I know. We really appreciate it. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. No ass kissing, please. Just watch out. Next time your brother fucks up, you're both gone ASAP. Look, I'm not trying to bust your balls, but this is a pot farm and he's a fucking kid. You hear me? Got it. Got it. I'll keep him out of the way. You better. This business has enough shit already. What, what kind of shit? shit? Jesus. What is this, an interrogation? Oh, uh, no. I'm sorry. Sorry. Okay, time's up. Have. Get the fuck out of here. You got a lot of work to do today. All right. Uh, thank you. With the pot man, but I was pressing my luck to see what he do. Hey. You okay? Now for the fun part. I need this all done by tonight. No excuses. So, get on it. All right, we good? Yeah, Finn is playing boss with his crew. I told him they'd all work late if they didn't finish on time. I hope so. Okay, I gotta make some calls. Well, what are you waiting for? You know the drill. <sighs> what? Dude, you such ass. I feel like I'm in prison. Shh. Mira almost kicked us out because you're a big mouth. What part of Lalo don't you get? You shouldn't even be here. Sure. I, I bet you wish I wasn't here. Oh, stop. I can tell. You know exactly what I meant. 
Oh, I feel you, Daniel. Sometimes I get stir crazy in here, too. Look, I know you guys are having the time of your life here, but I'm not. So shut your mouth and give me some quiet for fuck's sake, okay? Well, why do you stick around then? None of your damn business. <sighs> but I'd be long gone if I had the chance. Trust me. All right, man. Just pick a bud and get to it. Oh, this is nothing. Last spring, we were trimming about two or three pounds a day. Whoa! That's a lot. Yep. Had to work overnight all the time. 15 hours straight once. Yeah, trying to forget. Ah, uh, gotta make sure I, I get it right. I was done with Kush after that. <clears throat> Whoa. We are lucky. Right, and then your arms fall off. Fuck all that. You got any reception? Going too fast. This place is a Take cell. your time, dude. Oh, of yeah. course. I should clean my scissors. They're a mess. <laughs> Keep messing it up. What? I pressed it! Oh, come on. Ouch! Shit. Ooh. You okay, sweetie? It's okay. You're doing fine. Just... slow down if you need to. I know. I will. Thanks, John. Ah, I keep mm -hmm. trying to get it. Let's just cut it. Hmm. Ugh. Mm, my ass hurts. Fuck, this is really boring. Oh, poor baby. That's the job. Don't think, just work. Okay. Just don't ask me to smile for the camera all day long. Feels like working in a factory. Imagine doing this for years. See? Sean agrees with me. As always. This is fun at first, but it does start to get old after a while. How about stop bitching so much? Sean, you're already on Meryl's shit list. Don't get us all kicked out of here. Just sit and trim. Damn, Sean. We really need to do something about your hair. What? What? What's wrong with my hair? Are you kidding me? It's hiding your pretty face. I can't allow that. <laughs> Come on. It's not that bad. Just... Just a mess. Yes. But worry not. We've got everything to take care of it at the game. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> we'll see. Anything but red. Come on now. But for real, though, if you could snap your fingers and go anywhere. Cassidy, we get it. Over and over. You don't want to be here. Give me a break. I can't. So what? So I'm allowed to dream a little? You won't get hurt. <laughs> Promise. What about 
Louisiana. Must be so sweet this time of year. Jesus. Okay, man. <laughs> Come on. Dream big. I'd like to see the pyramids. Or the top of Mount Fuji. Sean Diaz. Global traveler. Yeah. Stalking Humboldt. No. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Nobody's yeah. making you babies work here. No problem. You guys are all the same. Cool, you. let's be trim immigrants. Then you barely work for a month. Oh, this is Yo, my life. Come here for a sec. <sighs> Shit. It's always something. Damn. Can you folks put a lid on it? We got shit to do here. Whoa, whoa. Down. Easy for you to say, cowgirl. Some of us have to work. Please. I bust my ass like everybody else. Uh-huh. Don't even. You're always looking for an excuse. Ooh, it's 420. Hey, Sean, let's talk. Ow, <sighs> my arm hurts. Wah, wah. Get off my crack, Hannah. <sighs> Why is it not going? Two months? I didn't come out to California to live on a fucking farm. I want to see some water. Are we gonna squat out here forever? Build a house? What? Stop! You know we voted to stay for a while. Once it's legal, Just we ain't got no more job here. Shit. How's it going? Same as always. They want everything by tomorrow. Friday? How are we supposed to... Hope I I'm cut up a lot. This place. Then go! I just feel like Daniel about to fuck up somehow the and then off. I'm gonna have to... If we're a family, Make up for him. we stick together. You're on the bus. What's this? We're off the bus. Hey. She just needs freedom, dude. Exactly. Thank you, darling. Hmm. Just grow up, Cassidy. Stop acting like a princess. Thanks, Mom. Anything else? Yeah. But we don't Come have on. the time. Did you I'm so zeroed in on trying to do this. Or what? Because I really feel like Daniel's gonna do something, and I don't want to me fucking up to result in him fucking up. Fuck this shit. Hannah, sorry. I know. Hey, I don't want to fight. It's been a long, crappy week. Just keep it fucking down in here, okay? Had to cut up the work. Oh my god. Cheer up, my little Sean. <laughs> Trust me, it's not as bad as you think. Other farms in the area is just straight down exploit your ass. You gotta be careful with those scissors. They're sharp as fuck. Yeah, no shit. Oh, you'll get scars, but you'll get it. Part of the fun. Ain't sexier. Later, Big Joe. Smile, asshole. So, did you have a good day at work, honey? I did. Love the Jerry Springer moment when Hannah and Cass started picking on each other. <laughs> Facts yeah. Start going back and forth. They love to start shit with each other, then get high. <laughs> Short term memory loss. How was your day? Did you have fun outside? <laughs> nope. Picked up branches and shit, got covered in mud. Would not recommend. Still sounds better than sitting on your ass all day. I feel you, Sean. As always. That's why you're such a good fit for the family. You totally hooked us up. 
A job, cash, friends, safety. Josh, everybody's cool with you two. <laughs> Daniel is your secret weapon. I don't know. He's way too young for this bullshit. You gotta be zen about this. The more you try and control him, the less you have. It's deep, huh? Swear, he acts just like me. <laughs> That's how I know he's smart. <coughs> uh, he's also got a kick-ass hermano. <laughs> yeah, my brothers are like that. What's your so, story? What's your story? Um, I mean, you don't have to tell me, but... Yeah, I was pretty lucky. My parents were okay. <laughs> I had three big brothers who spoiled me. Aww. <laughs> you were the baby boy? Like Daniel. <laughs> but my family was kind of... Mm, messed up. My dad was like a front for hot cars. Yeah. He'd steal, strip, and sell them. My brothers and I helped him. You know, typical shit. Till we got busted. <laughs> Fucking feds wanted me and my brothers to testify. <laughs> but my dad narked on us instead. Damn, Finn. That sucks. Uh, <laughs> what happened? I went to jail. When I got out, I was like, fuck everybody. <laughs> so I hit the road, Jack, and... Anyways, I found a cooler family out here. You know, I love traveling, checking out new things. Yeah, never gets old. <laughs> well, going to Mexico is the ultimate road trip. If we make it there, dude, who knows? It's pretty scary. Not so for real. fucking far. Hey, hey, it is, but... You have time and a strong, uh, damn it, uh, will. Yeah, N nothing can stop you from going there. It will be all right, Sean. Don't worry. Okay. Therapy's over. Oh, yeah. I gotta move those water tanks for the shower and stuff. It's cool you're doing your part, Sean. Finally. Glad I can help. So, Hannah, how long ago did you come here to Humboldt for work? Nine years. I love Santa with Bay, that, no money. we money. gonna sit in this Short, chair real cars. quick. Thank y'all for watching. All good things must come to an end. Oh my goodness. We have to try to get a rein in on Daniel. I was an only child, so I don't really know what this would do. If I had a real brother. Um. Uh. Wow. We have to make sure that Finn is not a wild ass. Bad influence on him. We have to make sure that we get our work done in a reputable fashion. We gotta make sure that everything is done right. But that's a concern for the next time we log in. Till next time, y'all. I am Steph. Peace.